On the upcoming SpaceX CRS-10 resupply mission to the International Space Station, a Dragon spacecraft will deliver the Stratospheric Aerosol and Gas Experiment, or SAGE-3 instrument, to study ozone in the atmosphere. Once mounted on the space station, SAGE-3 will measure the Earth's sunscreen, or ozone, along with other gases, aerosols, and tiny particles in the atmosphere. Following years of global efforts to significantly reduce the number of ozone-depleting substances, experts now are optimistic that the ozone layer will recover. While launch of SAGE-3 is scheduled for early 2017, preparations have been in work for several years. SAGE-3 team actually began back in September of 2011. We sent a delegation of engineers out to Langley to meet with the SAGE team and to learn a little bit about their payload and to um, offer our expertise here at KSC and how we could help make their payload successful. SAGE-3 now is being tested in the high bay of Kennedy Space Station Processing Facility, or SSPF, a world-class processing laboratory. Every American launched element for construction of the ISS, all cargo and each experiment is prepared and checked out in the SSPF, a crucial part of a premier multi-user spaceport. KSC offers host role support to the Stage 3 team when they arrive at KSC. Basically, we offer them anything they need to make their work here in the SSPF high base successful. One unique requirement that the Stage 3 team had was the need for a, a super clean room. We spent about a year to develop, um, design, and build a super clean, clean room, clean tent in the SSPF uh, high bay. And this is considered a class 10K clean room, which basically means that within any given cubic foot of air inside the tent, there are less than 10,000 particles greater than a half a micron in size. So, and this is due to the sensitivity and the optics of the payload. Um, this 10K clean tent is actually about 10 times cleaner than the air in the SSPF high bay. It's about 150 times cleaner than the air in the average living room. To ensure SAGE-3 will be ready to go to work once it arrives at the space station, Kennedy experts have been assisting Langley Research Center engineers in conducting extensive checkouts in the special processing area of the SSPF. I've been more involved in um, helping them coordinate their testing with our ISS simulators so that they can do their command and data handling checkouts and make sure that everything's going to um, flow the data correctly once they're on orbit and gathering science. Once SAGE-3 is installed on the space station, it will begin sending back data. So what's great about this science is they're going to try to see or verify whether those efforts that have been made here on Earth have actually helped improve the ozone layer back. I just wish all the payload teams um, and the science teams great success. Um, I know they're doing important work for our, our future generations.